Parkinson and I live in Luton. My name is Chuck Stevens, I live in New York. Oh yeah. <laughs> and I'm Lloyd and I live in Palms Green. Okay, so what do you work at Lloyd? Um, oh, you're doing nothing. <laughs> I don't do anything. Um, I work for Swiss Bank Corporation in, in London. So what, what do you like about London? Um, not a lot really. <laughs> <laughs> not a lot. I mean, apart from working, I'd just as well not be living anywhere else. It's better than Luton. I'm not going to say it's better than Luton. I'm not going to say it's better than Luton. I will not admit to it anyway. <laughs> well, so you often come to parties like this? Um, occasionally. Occasionally. You're a pie really, don't you? Yeah. I think you ought to go on to Chuck and who looks desperate. Okay, Well, I like the interest in meeting people you meet, you know, with video cameras and that sort of thing. <laughs> they sort of quaint sort of English habit of coming on, you know. False accent, false accent. <laughs> what do you think I'm Henny yet. Uh, it doesn't look safe to me. <laughs> what doesn't look safe? <laughs> so have you drank a lot? <laughs> <laughs> with the candidates <laughs> evidence. I've got my car keys. Yeah, right. <laughs> I got my car keys as well. How was it for you? How was what for him? <laughs> Have you always lived in London? No, I've never lived in London. You don't live in London? No, now? I don't live in London. Oh, I live in Luton. Oh, that's nice Lovely. Yes, that's Lovely. Right. About 30 miles outside London. What do you think of London City? From what I've seen of it, it's fine if I don't have to live London there. City. London, London City. London City? No, you haven't been oh, well, there. We've got somebody else here. Well, <laughs> well, <laughs> yeah. well, I have my job covers London City and I think, no, I wouldn't live in that's London, the city that's of London, if I had to. If I had to live in a choice, I'd live just outside. It's yours, every time the camera catches I like my green open space, it's not been getting much of that in Luton, but... Any camera, but I try not to... You don't. Where'd you live? Austin, didn't you? What's your name? Lorraine. And how long are you living in London? Five years. And where did you live before? In Green Hills and Dublin. <laughs> and what do you think of living in, living in London? I love living in London. It's superb. I've got all my friends. I've got a great job. I've got a nice car, a nice flat. And what more can I say? <laughs> Would you move back to Ireland? No, I'd never move back to Ireland because it's too slow. The atmosphere is like... A bit laid back, <laughs> and I just like the fast life. I like move. Oh What's your plans for the future in London? What's my plans for the future is to buy a big house, have a big garden. Hadley Wood. And in, in, no, no, no. Oh, Hadley Wood, I'd love. But I've I've moved down to Harpenden at this stage. But I would love Hadley Wood. I would love Hadley Wood. Um, <laughs> Harp Harpenden is the place I'd like to live, and I want a five-bedroom house, massive garden, and uh, my friends to come around and stay with me at the weekends. Brilliant. Yeah. So are you gonna have kids? Maybe. <laughs> Maybe. What's your ideal number of kids? One boy or one girl? One girl. Number the first one, be. <laughs> one boy and one girl. Why do you have to say, Lorraine? Thanks a lot for the interview. Come on. One these. Yeah, yeah but. Liverpool and London. Liverpool and London. There's more scallies in Liverpool. And that's like, do you prefer living in London or? I've never lived in Liverpool. Well, St. Helens. Oh, St. Helens. Oh, yeah, I prefer living in London, thank you. Will you ever move back to St. Helens? No. What, what, what excites you about London? Um. I love the milk floats in particular, the way they go up and down the road gets me quite excited. Um, I love it when the tube doesn't turn up for about 20 minutes and I quite enjoy having the odd argument with the barman about the round of drinks I've ordered. 
I didn't actually order that Perrier. You know? I'm Rio Egan. And you're obviously from Ireland? Yeah, yeah, I'm from Cork. <laughs> How long have you moved to London? Um, two years. Very happy two years. <laughs> Only ever moved back happy to New York. birthday. <laughs> um, oh, I will. I will, yeah. I'll go back to Cork. Um, but it'll be a few years. It'll be a while. Be a while. Like, did you used to live near a big city? Oh, yeah, I'm from the city. city. I'm a city girl. I'm a city girl. I'm a city girl. You were not a big city. Say well, talents. You're used to the city all your life. <laughs> You're used to the city life. Oh, that's me. Slick, sophisticated. What more can I ask for? <laughs> Where are you from? Uh, I'm from Cork. Yep. Uh, how long have you lived in London? Happy. Um, <laughs> uh, three years. And what college did you have to move to London? To get a job. And have you got your job? I have. Hey, what a yeah, that's not too bad. Happy? Happy? So, <laughs> are you going to live here for the rest of your life? Uh, no, <coughs> definitely not. Where do you plan to move? All for the rest of your life? Uh, no, <coughs> definitely not. Where do you plan to move? I'll probably go to Dublin, I think. Dublin? Yeah. What, what do you like about Dublin? <laughs> I like Dublin people. <laughs> Connor and Dave, you're there. Dublin. And they go drinking all the time, so I'm going to go there. Where are you from? I'm from, uh, I'm from London. All your life? Yes, all my life. Except three years when I was in Sheffield where I met John. Tell me about the golf club. Which golf club? Your favourite golf club? La Manga. Oh, well, tell us about that. It's, it's a playground, playground for the rich. John's taken me there a few times. What are you doing there? Well, I go along as John's escort because he likes to play with little boys. <laughs> Yeah, his friends call him Michael Wacko Baines. Why did you never leave London like the rest have left their hometown? Um, because there's far too much to do here, far too much entertainment and far too many good jobs. No. Why? It's full of Irish. My sister's friends. And I've tried to interview them, but as you can see, they've had a few drinks. Well, that's all from London for today. And tomorrow we're going bungee jumping.
This is my sister. What do you think? It's, it's good, though, isn't it? It's like it feels really weird. Again. <laughs> <laughs> 
it before she's got on. Was it? Yeah. Oh yeah, fast it's pumping away. Slow down actually. Would you do it again? Yeah. That was good, like a, did you open your eyes? Um yes. I closed them when I was falling. When, when I'm falling down I went. <laughs> Yes, I yeah. <laughs> yeah. But it was, what I found horrible is when you come down, right, and you go back up to the air really lightly, right, and then the tension is completely go, and it's like what becomes broken. Yeah. You just go wham back down again. <laughs> it was unbelievable. unbelievable. So you're going to do the 400 foot one? Yeah. Oh, God. Twice the height of that. Oh, God. Do you want to watch it on the video before it goes? Yeah. City of London. <laughs> 